So I'm gonna pour the plate. I'll be back. Sorry. And then you basically pour it onto the plate and you go to all four corners and then I drain off the excess. It, it will brighten up when it dries and it'll brighten up. So it'll get even brighter than this. Yeah. I'm just changing now. I was on my phone, so. Little outfit change. This is gonna be the last shot. I had so much fun today, Carrie, you're the best. And I really needed this today. I needed to be inspired. But this is pretty interesting, I mean, come on. With my tangled cords? Yeah. Two tint dives by Kevin Klein. Mm -hmm. Well, he's extremely experienced. He's done it for 30 years, and so he did this as a gift for me. And then this is by Ryan. This is a digital image that he projected, I believe, mm -hmm. and then took a wet plate of the projection. In Italy. Okay. The, the catacombs. It's the Piazza della my, one of my first wet plates that was taken of me, this is a print that uh, Shane took. This is before I learned, and the reason why I love this plate and this print is because I'm holding a collodion bottle. And then I learned how to do it, so yeah. it's, it's like sentimental to me. Um, this is by Kevin Klein as well. He does yeah. analog printing, which is one of my favorite. Yes, such a cool, just, uh, it's very vintage. He's, he's extremely um, authentic when it comes to the process. Mm -hmm. This tint type they were gonna throw, but I were sentimental and I was like, I don't love the rips. Now this is a glass print mm. of Shane's work, but the reason why I have it is because he taught me how to use the farmer's reducer on this plate, the original plate. What's and that? so it's the chemical that erases like flaws in the blacks. So his plate here he made had stains and I applied he let me apply that chemical and it cleaned up those edges. Organization here. What in the world? It's like, how did it come to this? I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we might have to 